see if anybody comes on here. So we told you we'd come live and here we are. Hey, hey, hey. You guys will probably be watching the replay because it's kind of early. Yeah. But we were so excited that we could not wait. Well, I couldn't wait to show you yeah. the one that I am really, really in love with. And this is the Grand Design 367 BH BHS. BHS. So this is the one that we've looked at. That we this is this is what our next upgrade is going to look like, and we figured we'd share with you guys. So we're going to start. So Ruth is going to give you a tour. Here, let me flip this camera over. All right, here you go. So if anybody comes on while we're on, say hello so we can know that you're on. We got <coughs> two people on. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. If you're watching the replay. Don't forget to say hi and don't forget to hit that like button before you leave. Um, I'm going to give you guys a tour of the Grand Design 367 BHS. It is my favorite. It's the one we want. It is what, a solitude? No, right? it's a reflection. Oh, it's a reflection. The reflection 367 BHS. It's the one that I want badly, badly. So here we're going to start. Um, Beautiful, beautiful light colors. And this is what I love. This is what I love about um, this one. It's the light. You guys know how I hate the dark in my transcend. I love my transcend, but I don't like the dark. Look all of these, guys. Look at all these cabinets. Look at these couches. And guys, they are so comfortable. So comfortable. And it's a trifle. And it is a trifle, so it's a bed also. So you have all this room, but you still have a bed. Then over here we have our recliners, just like ours. You put your cup in here. There, a massager. A it's a heater. You can't beat that, man. I, Adrian says I'm a class air. I'd really be a class air with these recliners. So what's across from the recliners? Is the TV. And even though it's a little too small, Adrian likes them big. Check out more storage, guys. More storage. Check it out. Check this drawer out. Like, this is insane. And I so miss our fire. So this is yeah. one of my favorite Especially things. Especially living up in the mountains. This would be so cool to... Look, guys, there's more storage. And who doesn't love this island, guys? Who does not love this island? I know I do. Check this out. Got dirty dishes? Ah, who cares? You just cover them up with your We wash our dishes. We do. But I'm just saying, <laughs> if you don't feel like showing your dishes or whatever in here, you have all this beautiful counter space. Oh, and check this out. Even though this is dark, it's the nice dark. And the dark come with the light wood and the dark wood combination, I think it gives it just that contrast that this needs. But wait, guys, there is more. When I tell you that I love this, I am totally obsessed. Counter space, drawers, You got a little drawer here for your pots. Check this oven out, guys. Check it out. That is insane. I don't need more than three burners, do you? I've never used all four at the same time. It so this depends is depends how many people we got coming. Perfect. Over. Look at the size of this microwave. So let's look at some comments real quick, see who's here. Yes. We pick up our new travel trailer tomorrow. Almost the same setup, real living space. Oh, right. I'm jealous. You're making me jealous, Mike. You're making me jealous. Thanks for being here, Mike. <laughs> Hi, Darla. Check it out. Beautiful, beautiful. And guys, I think this is Adrian's favorite part of this RV. Second favorite, but yes. Check out this refrigerator. Huge. It's a real fridge. Huge. Plenty of drawers. Check it out. I mean, seriously, is this an RV or is this a house? Yeah. 
Like, I mean, let me put this back. I want to put things. Look at this pantry, guys. It is crazy, crazy, crazy. You got another drawer up here. It goes up. I can't get it up. <laughs> Some nice storage up there. Okay. Let us go into my second favorite thing. A real table, guys. You guys know I hate my dinette. Look at this table. Real chairs. I absolutely love it. You could take out if you only want two chairs. This side, you can take that out for more space. Take the chairs out. Okay. And you come over here. I'm so going to let... This is my favorite. Thing. This is Adrian's favorite. So we're going to let him... So this is what I want. And... It's a mid bunk, they call it. But this is a trifold couch, so to open up, and it's a bed. So if you have many guests, so now you have one here and one in the back. So that's two places for people to stay in. But I would use this as an office. Here, I'll show you this. You can put your TV here. Um, I can set up monitors. I can even take the couch out and set up a nice big work area that would just stay there. And it would be awesome because we have the bed back there and Ruth's got a surprise for you guys. Um, the desktop is a little small, but it's cool, you know. So there's plenty of storage here. You can actually put some shelving in there and, and make it a little nicer. Um, drawers, I would use this for equipment probably. And then there's all your electronics and, and things. It doesn't have the barn door, but it's still a door. So when I... When she's uh, doing something, I could just close the door. <laughs> well, that's rude. <laughs> Come with me because I'm going to show you guys my very, very favorite. So we still have Adrian's office, which is what he needs, but we still have an area for our grandkids to come. And that is... It's a little loft. And we actually have a video that's going to come out and it actually shows Adrian getting in there. But you got some nets over there. Yep. And then I think at some point it connects to the cabinet on the other side. But so, yeah, I mean, it's you got plugs, you got everything. And check this bathroom out, guys. Look at this bathroom. Look how big this bathroom is. And guys, I mean... Not to get freaky or anything, but two people fit in here, guys. Comes with an upgraded, beautiful shower head. And there's plenty of headroom. Plenty of a headroom for if you're a tall person. I like the glass doors. And even though this is dark wood, it's gray. It's not your brown, ugly, dreary gray. So it's beautiful. But look at all this extra cabinet space i mean really and look at this here ah you can set up control your hot water that is awesome which is perfect in the bathroom and one of my favorite 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 things about this rv are you guys ready you guys ready because i am about to blow your socks off Voila! You guys, is this not a oh, a woman's dream of a closet? Like, check that out, okay? Check it out, guys. Is that not insane? And if you wanted to, you could take these off on either side and put a washer and a dryer. Yep, you got the hookups here on each side for the dryer. The washer hookup is on the other side. And you would still have all that great space. But I don't have to feel like I'm working out to make the bed. Look, there's plenty of room for my big bot, guys. Check it out. I would have to, of course, upgrade the bed. Oh, we'll just bring your own. Look room. at all this room. It's got controls for your AC because, as you guys know, if it's too hot, too cold, you got to walk across the whole thing. Check this out. Check out these drawers, guys. Like, who says that you cannot live comfortably in an RV? Nowadays, that is so not true. And I can tell you that living a whole year in ours. And we have plenty of space, but this is yep. 
my dream come true. It checks off all my boxes. And then she I, has a door that she can yeah. shut me out. I kind of like that. <laughs> Here is your control panel for your awnings and every your slides and everything else that you have. This unit uh, has three slides, I believe. Yes. One here. You have the main one here and then the one in the bedroom. So, but this loft, isn't that cool? I mean, you know, the kids could sleep up there. You're Even here. though our grandkids don't camp with us as often as we would like. But they're still will. Okay. Adrian and I have talked about it and we feel like if we omit it, at least have a way for them to come and camp, that we would miss it. And yeah. I don't want this, this actually is the best of both worlds yeah. because we have a bigger fridge yeah we have definitely. more room to entertain if even though we don't and then if someone stays with us there you go there's a bed there so so guys what do you think tell us below so we wanted to bring you guys live with us while we looked at Ruth's favorite one this is um, the one I want I don't know that we'll walk away today or this week with one of these, but um, it's on the list. <laughs> it's on the list. I have all week to convince him. You guys, tell us below, should we get this RV or should we wait and see if something better? Hi! Hi, man, I'm living a uh, freeze of gold. How are you guys doing? How Thanks are you guys here. doing? Thank you for being here. So, yeah, we're just touring Grand Design first, and then we're going to go hit up... Uh, some of the other Jayco. brands. We have, we have Jayco. Jayco and Alliance. Next, and then we're doing Alliance. So we're going to review. day one and there's a lot more to come. So there is a lot you never know of stuff here. When we're going to go live again. So. Yep. So just keep an eye on. Make sure that your notifications are on all. And look what I got here. Yes. So if you guys want one of these stickers. Let me, let me go on here and You can go to. Right now I'm going to put it on RVLifeProductions.com which is our website. Life. And you can get a channel sticker which looks like our logo. Or these are for our RV Lifer Nations. If you guys go and sign up for this and become part of our RV Lifer Nations you will get just, one of these stickers. I just put oh, the link. There you go. Ruth put the link. And um. Thanks for being here with us. And yes, definitely. Thanks for being here. And if you have, if you're watching this replay, just say watching the replay. Let us know where you're watching from. Um, but if you want, there's something specific that you guys want to see. Let us know. Yeah. Um, if there's a class B or class C, whatever it is. Now our poll that we put up a couple of days ago, most people want um, uh, towables, like so fifth wheels, travel trailers. So that's kind of what we're gonna uh, do, but we're gonna sprinkle in no, the others we're gonna as well. Do, we're gonna so do mostly all of them. You guys will be pretty surprised at what we show you guys. And so. this one is a fifth wheel. Yes. This is a fifth wheel. It is. Um, so it's a towable. It's a towable. Yep. And what is what are the wrecks on it? Why don't you show them the outside? Yeah, let's go outside. I'll stay here. Has plenty of storage. Oh, this is the outdoor kitchen. Yeah, this is my. This is why I like this unit because it has an outdoor kitchen. Okay, it doesn't have the sink, but it has the port like my RV does now for the sprayer, which is that's all you need. Okay, and here is your underbelly storage. If I could get. It's pass through. It's pretty large. It's kind of nice because you can get in there. Or I got to crawl underneath mine. Now obviously your propane is here. I'm not sure if this is generator ready, but it may be. But it does have solar, some solar panels. Uh, yep, it is generator ready, I believe. It's got the ground control, auto leveling, 
You guys saw that video when I installed it in ours. So, let's go to this side here. This is kind of cool how they split this. So you got your wet area here. And then this door opens separately if you need it. So it's kind of cool. And you got the two awnings, one up there, one over there. And you got the, the more ride steps with the more ride suspension, I believe this has as well. So there is Ruth. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I really, really, really love it. And I really, really, really want it. But there's so many here. And we have... And this, is a, this is the media day. So we get free access to this yes. without a lot of people. So we're going to try to get as much content as we can for you guys. And yeah. we're going to try to get at least all of them. Um... At least a little bit of all of them, so you guys can see yeah. sneak peek of all the latest. And you'll see and videos brands. throughout the week that we're going to put out um, of the different units and different brands. So. But before you guys leave, don't you guys forget? Face yourself, Ruth. Hit that <laughs> like. Oh, I know, I know. I, you know that I, I said it. That, that I am going to pace myself. Yeah. But this has been my dream one. Yeah. That's why I'm starting with this one because I know the other ones will probably get better. <laughs> Well, well I don't we, know. I we don't like know. grand design, and it's 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 what we you know it made been good to us. Um, and this is the the solitude's a little much for us, I think. Yeah. I think this is a good next step. So. Yeah. Besides, we can pull with our truck this yes. one, can we? Yeah. That's another big thing too. We just bought our truck in March, even though it has a lot of miles because we yeah. travel a lot. But um, we want to keep our truck for a little bit. Yeah, before... I don't want to get a truck every year, especially if it's super, super I expensive. I know, now. I know. But, but we, so we have to stay within the parameters of what we can pull with our truck, and this, this checks off all the boxes. This will even do, though so. we we got footage, even though we got footage of another mid bunk, um, it's a little yeah. bit. It had the. So over here, it had barn doors that led into it. This was over here, um, but it had just. Oh, in the back. The dinette was in the back, so it's a little different. Was huge. Yeah, so huge. that's something we got to look at. Yeah. But I remember what I didn't like about that one. It didn't have the, the little. Loft. The loft. So it doesn't have the loft up there, which I think that's a big deal for us because of our grandkids. It really is. And so. you know, people, I was talking to somebody about it and they were like, well, how often do your grandkids camp yeah. with you guys? Honestly, it's only a couple of times a year, but you know what? If we didn't have it, then we, I would miss it. Yeah. I don't know. I know. I know that I sounds kind of crazy. We still got a while to decide, so. Says, hey, Glam fam. Maybe how not. How are you? Hey, Glam fam. Welcome, welcome. Well, like I said, you never know. We might go live yes. later, tomorrow, tonight. Yes, yes. We're so, going to be going live throughout the week. Yep. Anything interesting? We just wanted to start with this one. Because, because this, this is what we want. And this is yes. the one that we absolutely love. So just give a quick walk around for those who came, who are coming. Just right. a quick, just a so quick. So if you're watching the replay, here's a recap. You have a trifold bed, a storage above. Nice recliners. Oh, you got the island and roof loves. <laughs> Three Look burner stove with a right giant here. oven. Love, love, love this. This is my favorite. A real fridge. It's locked up. The pantry. Pantry. We have some storage up there. My favorite thing is what would be my office. and plenty of space and then here's the loft that ruth was talking about in case you guys missed it it's an actual bed up above and it has the built-in steps show them my favorite the bathroom part. is nice nice size shower with some storage and my favorite part the closet and ruth's favorite part is the closet so it's a big bed with a big area but this is her favorite part is the closet you can put washer dryers in here 
or you can leave it all as a closet. Um, Built-in dresser, and you can put a TV. So, this, like I said, is probably gonna be what we're looking for next, but, all right, Ruth. So listen, say guys, hi to everyone. we will talk to you guys yes. next time. And after la there prima. is tons, tons more. Yeah. And we will be sharing with you guys. So make sure that your notifications is to all because when you put it sometimes, it goes to personalize. Yep. And guys, before you leave, please hit that thumbs up. It helps us so, yep. so much. We love you guys for it. And until the next one. Hasta la próxima.